Okay, today I'm shipping with Viber. It's a highly requested build that I got over and over again, and I finally got around to building tutorial of it. Anyways, the blocks you need are grey concrete, grey wool, grey powder, cyan terracotta, black grey concrete, black grey wool, black grey powder, black terracotta, grey terracotta, brown terracotta, brown concrete, brown wool, mushroom, yellow terracotta, yellow shulker box, red terracotta, pink terracotta, white concrete, white powder, white wool, bone block, and black concrete. Those are the blocks you need to polish and I'll grab all of them. Okay, the first nine blocks you need is your gray concrete to your gray terracotta, so grab that now. Okay, start your build. Get your lacquer wool and just place two. And place four lacquer concrete next to it. And then two lacquer wool. On either side of the great lacquer wool, pop it out three and go in one. Just like so. And get your lacquer concrete and just move it across. Okay, once done, you can drop your lacquer concrete and lacquer wool. Okay. Get your cyan terracotta, and on the front, just do a full row across. On the ends, go up one, and in the middle two blocks, go up one. In the four gaps, place your lacquer powder. Just like so. Okay. Once done, you can drop your lacquer powder. Okay. On top of each lacquer powder, place a cyan terracotta. In the far corners, place a gray bowl. Okay. In the two middle areas right here, get your gray wool and go up five blocks. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Get your gray powder and go across two rows now on either side, just like so. Then go across two gray concrete from the end going inwards. Then a gray wool on top of each gray concrete, like so. Fill those four gaps in with gray powder. Connect the gray powder from the top of the gray wool at the end, just like so, leaving the middle blank. And where you have this singular gray column, gray powder column going all the way up, go up one more, just like so. Okay, get your gray wool and make a square in the middle. Then make a T shape on the top, giving you a capital T. And on the ends, place two gray wool on both sides. Okay. On top of the T-shape in the middle, get your gray concrete and make a square. Okay. You can move your black terracotta and gray terracotta over and grab your browns. Start off, get your brown terracotta. Place one anywhere, it doesn't matter where, and pop it out. Make sure you're in the bottom left corner now and make a capital L, just like so. Okay. To the right of it, place two brown concrete. On the bottom brown concrete, place the brown terracotta, then a brown concrete on top of it. Now to do the same image, same shape, reversed over here. So capital L, but it's time backwards. Two brown concrete, brown terracotta, and a brown concrete on top of it, just like so. And with that, the front of the right bird is done. Pause if you need to. Okay, we go on the side down. Start off, get your cyan terracotta, and move across two rows. Okay, then go across two gray concrete and then a gray wool. Okay, you can cross five rows of gray powder. One, two, three, four, five. Then a row of gray wool. Then pop out a row of brown terracotta. On the ends, go up one brown terracotta. And place two brown concrete in the middle, just like so. The other side of his leg is the exact same. Get your sign terracotta, move it across two rows. Then two gray concrete, one gray wool. Five rows of gray powder. Just like so. For a gray wool. A row of brown terracotta popped out. On the ends, go up one brown terracotta. In the middle, place two brown concrete, just like so. 
Okay. Make me one backside. In the middle, make a square of grip powder. On either side of the square, make a square of cyan terracotta to connect it, like so. Get your grave wool and go all the way across in the next row. Okay. Get your grey powder and go in one from each end. Then go across four grey wool in the middle. Then go across three grey wool in the middle, starting from the right. Okay. In the two middle blocks, go up two columns of three. One, two, three. Just like so. Okay. Go to the top row where the grey wool is and connect it all the way across, just like so. Next, get your grey powder and go all the way up to tippy top, filling in the gaps like so. Okay. Next, get your brown terracotta, pop it out and move it all the way across. On the ends, go up one, and the middle is all brown concrete, so fill that in. With that, the back of your vibrator legs is done. Pause if you need to. Okay. With that, you can drop all your grays. Okay. And let's reorganize the inventory. Let's move all the blacks over here. We're going to need the mushroom block and the yellows. Mushroom, yellow, and might as well bright terracotta. Okay. Above the gray. Uh, conquer right here, get shell terracotta, and pop it out too. Okay. Go to the side of hand and get your mushroom. And right here where the arm, I mean the jacket's popped out, just do a full row of mushroom on top of it. And to left of that, go out three black terracotta on each block. Just like so. Do the same for the other side. On top of the row of the jacket, place a full row of mushroom. Then pop out three black terracotta on top of each mushroom block. Just like so. Okay, next, get your gray terracotta on the arms. Place one in each corner, or just two corners, doesn't really matter. Then pop it out for both arms and surround it twice. So two rows of gray terracotta popped out on both arms. Just like so. That's one. And that is two. Just like so. Okay. Next, get your brown concrete and move in two for the middle, like so. Okay. Go inwards. And just get a row, place of blocks right here above the yellow terracotta. And go up two columns of three. Go behind the placing blocks and place the yellow shulker box facing the underside on top of them. And it shows like that. Of course, if you don't want to use shulker box, you just use yellow terracotta because they're pretty much the same color. Okay. On the far left side of the shulker boxes, get your, gray ter get your brown terracotta and go up three. On the right side, place one brown concrete and then go up two brown terracotta. Just like so. Get your brown terracotta and wrap it around a row on top of each hand, just like so. All the way around, and all the way around. Go to the bottom of the body and get your brown terracotta and connect it to the arms, like so. Okay, on the left arm, where this column of brown terracotta is, go up three more. Pop out one to the left. Go up four more. One, two, three, four. And the top two, pop down two brown terracotta on the right. Just like so. Okay, next, the next column over where this brown concrete is, go all the way up to the tippy top. And fill these two gaps in as well. Just like so. Okay. Go to his right arm, get your brown concrete, and go across two rows. On the far left end, place a brown terracotta. And fill the rest in with brown concrete to the tippy top, just like so. Okay. Go to where this three column of brown terracotta is, and place the brown concrete on top of it, and same with the two brown terracotta. Okay, between those two brown concretes, place black terracotta, and a diagonal to top of both those black terracottas, like so. 
do a square of placing blocks on top of the black terracotta. Get your yellow choker box and place it behind, just like so. On top of each black terracotta on the ends, go up two brown terracotta. Okay, now connect the two brown terracottas with the black terracotta in the middle, and go up a diagonal once again. Place two placing blocks in the middle, go behind and get your yellow choker box, just like so. Okay, place a brown terracotta on top of each black terracotta, and then pop out two yellow terracotta at the top, just like so. Once done, you can drop yellow, your yellows. Let's reorganize the inventory a bit and move those over. Okay. With this brown, with this column of brown concrete, is go all the way up to the last block, like so. And then get your brown terracotta and go across two blocks, just like so. Okay, go to this column of brown terracotta down here. Go in two and go up one on the far left, giving you this shape. You go four brown concrete on top of that, like so. Okay. Go across three brown concrete in the bottom row and go in two brown concrete from the far right. Get your pink terracotta and on top of each brown concrete place one, just like so. Once done, you could drop your brown ter I mean your pink terracotta. Okay. On the two pink terracottas. On the far left one, go up three red terracotta, and to the right of it, go up two red terracotta, like so. Okay, once done, you can drop your red terracotta. Okay, you grab your whites now. On top of the far right pink terracotta, place a brown terracotta, then a white concrete on top of it, just like so. Next to the bottom left pink terracotta, place a white wool. A white powder on top of it. You can replace your mushroom for a bone block right now. Place a bone block on top of the white powder. On top of the bone block, go up to white powder and go across through white powder to the right. Okay, get your brown concrete and go across three from the right like so. And place a brown terracotta. Okay. Grab your mushroom once again quickly. Where the yellow terracotta is, go behind it, go up. And place two like so and to end it off get your brown terracotta and do a full row popped out on top except for where the yellow terracotta is with that the front of reviver is done pause if you need to okay uh also you can do this if you want to it doesn't really matter it's not big a difference but you can uh where the shulker boxes are just grab your yellow terracotta and go behind and just like completely surround the inside of the shulker boxes because sometimes there's like a glitch where it, you know, shows it show, uh, like shows little cracks between the circle boxes, like right there. It's very, like, not a big deal, but like, if you notice it, it may annoy you. So I just do this. They'll really just like block all cracks and won't let it happen. Just like so. Okay. Now we want to the side of his arm. So off from the right side. Get your brown concrete and go across two rows. Then up a row of brown terracotta. Then four rows of brown concrete. And it ended off with a row of brown terracotta, just like so. Okay, now move on to the other side of his arm. Okay, start off, go across two rows of brown concrete. Okay, and go across a row of white concrete. Then a row of brown terracotta. Okay, and start from the left, place up white concrete, white powder, and two white concrete. On top of each white concrete, place a white powder, and place a white wool on top of the white powder right there. Next row is all white, all brown concrete, and next row is all brown terracotta. Just like so. Okay, now we can move on to his backside. We'll finish off the far left arm. Okay, get your brown terracotta. Place one on the far end, going up, and three brown concrete to the left of it. Go in two bar brown concrete from the far left. Place two white wool next to it. Okay. On top of the white wool, go across three white concrete towards the left. 
the far left block, paste a white powder with a brown terracotta on top of it. To the right of that brown terracotta, place three bone blocks upwards, or just all in the same direction, of course. On top of the brown terracotta, get your white concrete and move it across three to the right. On the far right, go up two white powder. On the far left white concrete, go up one white powder. And between those two white powders, place two white wool. On the far right white powder, go up two brown terracotta. Go across a row of brown concrete, and then a row of brown terracotta to end it off. Just like so. Once done, you can drop all your whites. Let's reorganize the inventory. Okay. Let's move on to the other side of his arm. Start off, get your brown concrete, and go across the full row. Okay, and get your brown terracotta, and on the far left row, left column, go all the way up to the tippy top. And then connect it, just like so, to the far right. Get your brown concrete, go across the row on the bottom. Place a brown terracotta on the far right corner. And then fill the rest in with the brown concrete to the tippy top. Just like so. And that the side of his arm is done, pause if you need to. Okay, let's move on to the top of his body, right here. Get your brown terracotta on the far left, move in two, and move in two from the right. Then place the brown concrete on both sides, and then connect those two brown concretes with brown terracotta. Okay. On the far left, get your brown terracotta and go down four blocks. One, two, three, four. It should be right at the same height as the bone block. Underneath that, place the brown concrete. Then go away to the bottom, get your brown terracotta, and connect to that brown concrete. Go in the far right corner, get your brown terracotta, and connect it to the second brown terracotta on the arm, right here. On top of that, place two brown concrete, and then place three brown terracotta, just like so. Go away to the down to the bottom, and move in two brown terracotta, one brown terracotta from each end. Okay. Go back to the tippy top, go across two rows of brown concrete, going down. In the middle, make a square of brown terracotta. And on the bottom blocks of the brown terracotta, move out one on each end, like so. All that done, get your brown concrete and fill the rest of the back in, just like so. All the way up to the tippy top. All the way. Filling in every, every gap. And with that, the back of your burr is done. Pause if you need to. Okay. The top of the shoulder blades are all brown terracotta, so let's fill that in. Pretty simple. Okay, and brown terracotta over here. Simple as is. Okay. Now we go into the front of his face. Now don't be confused, the part where we pop out is where these mushroom blocks are. So let's place one here for placement, and then pop out two. Then move it all the way across. Just like so, giving you four in length and three in width, like so. Okay, on the front of his face, do another row of mushroom on top of that. Okay, on the ends, make a square of mushroom block. In the middle, make a square of mushroom block. And on those four gaps, place black concrete. Once done, you can drop your black concrete. On his right eye, place a mushroom. Okay, let's move on to the left, his right side of his head. Go across another row of mushroom, and on the far left block, go up one mushroom. Okay. Let's go to, to the left side of his head. Just like so. On top of this two row right here, go across three. Go up one on each end, just like so. Once done, let me just double check the other side. Yep, all perfect, no holes. You can drop your mushroom block. Okay. Ah, shucks, guess I, I was wrong earlier. You still need your whites, so we grab those. If you have pick block, let's go pick block them right there on the sh shoulder. Okay. Set off in the bottom left corner, place a brown terracotta, and pop it out. To the right of it, place the brown concrete. 
on top of the brown concrete, place two brown terracotta going up. On either side of the top block, go out one brown terracotta on each side. On the far right brown terracotta, go up one brown terracotta. Okay, make a diagonal with your brown concrete, giving you three in total. On the top, under the top right brown concrete, go down two brown terracotta. And go across three brown terracotta on the bottom one. One, two, three. On the far right brown terracotta, go up one brown terracotta. And to the right of it, place two brown concrete. On top of the brown concrete, place a brown terracotta. A brown concrete on top of that. To the left of it, place two brown terracotta. And underneath the far left one, place a brown concrete. Giving you this weird shape. In a similar gap right here, place a white powder. In these two gaps right here, place white concrete. And in the three gap right here, place white powder. Just like so. In this top gap right here on the top of the head, get your brown concrete. And place two inwards like so. Okay. And right here, place a brown terracotta inwards as well. That's the front of Revive Bird done. Pause if you need to. Okay, we go on the side of the now. Get your brown terracotta and pop it out one and go across four blocks. One, two, three, four, giving you five in total. Then go across a row of four on top of it, going starting from the left. And then going two, sorry, from the left, like so. Okay. Right here on the bottom row, place a brown terracotta. On top of that, place two brown concrete and move out one brown concrete to the right. Place two brown terracotta on the far right. Okay. Where the two brown concrete is, go place two brown terracotta to the left of it. Get your brown wool. And place two brown wool to the left of that. And on the top left brown wool, move out one to the left. To the left of that, place a brown terracotta and a brown wool on top of that. On the two stack of brown wool, place a brown terracotta. And to the right of that, place five brown wool. In the middle of that brown wool line, place one brown wool going up. And to the right of it, place a brown concrete. To the left of that brown wool that went up, place two brown terracotta to the left. On top of the far brown terracotta you just placed, place, go up one and go across three to the right. On the far right block right here, next to the brown concrete, get your brown terracotta and go across four, giving you a little overlap. Okay, get your brown concrete and make a sideboard, sideways capital M like so. On top of the brown concrete that's still not covered, place a brown wool and fill the rest of the gaps in with brown terracotta, just like so. Okay, let's move on to the other side of his head. Mm -hmm. Get your brown terracotta, pop it out one and go across four to the back, popping off one block. Then go in four from the right leaving one gap at the bottom, and then going two from the right. On these two mushroom blocks right here, place two brown terracotta diagonally. Okay, on top of these brown terracottas and these mushrooms, get your brown wool and make this shape on top of them. Get your brown concrete and where these mushroom blocks are, place two to the right. On the far left brown concrete, go up two, go to one to the left, Go up one and go across three to the left, like so. In the far left column, go up one brown concrete. Place a brown terracotta next to it. And to the right of that, place three brown wool. Go down a brown wool on the far right one. Okay, start from the left, go in four brown wool. One, two, three, four. Giving you that shape. In the bottom right row, get your brown terracotta and go across three. Go up four brown terracotta on the far right. One, two, three, four. On the top one, go out one to the left. On the far left brown brown terracotta, go up two brown terracotta. Fill the rest in with brown concrete now. Okay. And now we can move on to the back side of his head. Get your brown terracotta, go all the way across the back, and pop out a full brow, just like so. Three blocks, like so. On the far left on the bottom, place one brown terracotta. 
then a brown wool, then a brown concrete, and then three brown terracotta. The top right diagonal of the brown wool, place the brown wool and go across three to the right, connecting it to the other brown wool on the far right. In the far right, place two brown concrete going in from the left. Place two rows of brown wool, brown terracotta I mean, to fill in the gaps. In the far left corner, place a brown concrete, and I can fill the rest in with brown terracotta. Just like so. Okay, and now we can finish off Reviber with the top of the skull. We're gonna go left to right. Start off, get your brown terracotta and go in two. Then a brown concrete. Then a brown wool. Then two brown terracotta. Get your brown wool and go across three. Then two brown concrete. Then a brown terracotta. Get your brown terracotta and go across four. One, two, three, four. Then a brown concrete. And then a brown terracotta. Get your brown terracotta and go across two. Then a brown concrete. And then two brown terracotta. Then a brown concrete. Get your brown terracotta and place one. Then a brown concrete. Then two brown wool. Then a brown terracotta. Then a brown concrete. Place a brown concrete. Then four brown wool. Then a brown terracotta. Next row, place a brown terracotta. Then a white wool. Then three brown wool. With that, Revive Burr is done. This has a request, and I think I've done it justice. If you have more Minecraft skins or YouTube's when we do, I can do it, or at least I can try.